Welcome to Journey of One. This is a show where I travel around Southern California to check out fun events and interesting places to see. Thanks for watching. Let's begin the journey. This week I begin a month of Halloween themed journeys by heading out to Mr. Bones Pumpkin Patch located in Culver City. This is a neat family focused pumpkin patch with hundreds of different pumpkins and gourds to take home along with plenty of activities for the kids to enjoy. I got a kick out of these 20 foot tall characters around the park. The skeleton especially reminded me of the old musical cartoons. Speaking of music, they have live music acts that perform throughout the day on this stage near the food trucks and eating areas so you can eat while listening. They also have these cool teepees set up if you want to get out of the sun, or one of a couple different bounce houses to jump in. If I'd been a bit smaller kid myself, I would have loved to have gone down these inflatable slides, or crawl around inside and through this kid-sized hay maze. Mr. Bones Pumpkin Patch also features a petting zoo, alongside rides on these beautiful ponies. But if real horses are a bit too much for you, there are a couple large wooden horses for you to ride instead. Once you've picked out a pumpkin you like, you can take it over to this booth and decorate it. Or you can have an artist named Pasher do an awesome and unique paint job for you. You can find a link to his site in the description below. They have all kinds of pumpkins here, more than I've ever seen in my life in one spot. They come in all shapes, sizes, and colors. It all lent to some fun pumpkin animals and decorations, like this pumpkin house. Once you've picked out and decorated all of your pumpkins, head over to the store to pay and pick up some other Halloween decorations before leaving Mr. Bones Pumpkin Patch. After leaving the pumpkin patch, my friend and I went into downtown Westwood to the Westwood Cemetery, where many famous celebrities have been laid to rest, finding it was a bit tricky as it was well hidden behind the skyscrapers. Once you find your way in, you'll be greeted by a small but very peaceful and beautiful cemetery. It's amazing to think that such a place would exist right in the middle of the city like this, providing an almost magical spot to visit and pay your respects to the people buried here. Down many of these serene walkways, you'll find the final resting places of many of Hollywood's greatest actors and actresses, as well as many other notables and non-famous regular people. There are several sanctuaries like this Sanctuary of Love for those who want to be laying above ground, as well as beautiful mausoleums and garden areas, making this a very pretty place just to take in. I personally love that many of the celebrities had a bit of a sense of humor about their resting places, many leaving funny quotes and inscriptions behind as one last joke. Probably most famous of all here is the resting place of Marilyn Monroe, with many paying respect by kissing the wall and leaving their lipstick behind. Reportedly, the open spot next to her is reserved by Hugh Hefner, who wants to spend eternity next to Marilyn. There are plenty of open spaces available if you'd also like to reserve a spot here for your body's final destination. Thanks for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe and check back all month long for more Halloween themed journeys.